Please state your name to the camera. My name is Margie Schillinger, but my grandkids call me Mima. Queen Kissy Show Productions presents the importance of family documentary. Will you please state your name for this interview? Angel Good. Okay, so Angel Good, this is my Aunt Angel. Um, we need you to tell us a little bit about your life and what's been going on. What do you want to know? We want to know about your children. I have two children. My oldest is a boy, and his name is Jesse Earl. How old is Jesse? Jesse is 19. He'll be 20 on December 31st. And Johanna is my daughter, and she is 12. And she is lovely. She's sitting over there, <laughs> relaxing. Okay, so we need to tell you what was your favorite moment with your children. My favorite moment with my children. Hmm, that's hard. <laughs> okay. Every moment is a favorite moment with my children because I just love them so much. And this is when it gets deep and dark. You might not think that, but... Angel is so caring and gives love to her children and is so warm-hearted. But Aww. they don't always are warm-hearted back. Aww. Okay, <laughs> so Angel, tell us about the time that you've spent doing your hair. <laughs> <laughs> the time that I've spent doing my hair, probably too much time because... I grew up in the 80s when everybody had big hair and hairspray and permanent waves and they ratted their hair clear up to kingdom come. So I'm just kind of now starting to let it be a little looser and, and flowy and flat because I'm used to big hair. Big hair takes a long time. So I'm working on getting the time down to like maybe 30 minutes instead of two hours. Oh, <laughs> okay. Now, thank you for telling us about your hair, but the biggest question of the night is, drum roll please. Hmm. Hmm. Are you ready for it? I'm ready. How old are you? I am 47 years young. <laughs> okay, Angel. Thank you for this interview. Thank you very much, Kaziah. She just month, died not too long ago. October. Ago. It's been a few years ago. She she, she was uh, almost 99. It was just a few days before her 99th birthday. You got 99 problems. She'd have lived longer had they not put her in the nursing home. She would have. What up, Johanna? It's your girl, Queen Kizzy Show. <laughs> okay. So, we just want you to tell us a few things about yourself. Okay, well, my name's Johanna Staples. We already know that. But and I am 12. And I like reading and writing. And my favorite color is blue. And my favorite fruit toppings. <laughs> How many siblings do you have? Including stepbrothers. Five. How many blood sibling? One. So I, Miriam, we're not gonna touch subject with this part because Johanna does not like talking about her parents split. But let's just say her dad's um new girlfriend has two sons, and then her new stepdad. You mean his wife? They're not married. Yeah, they are. Well, they're not. They got married. Well, anyway, her dad. I'm just kidding. <laughs> Her um her new stepdad has another two kids, or two boys. boys. Yeah, I it's, have all boy brothers. And her um her real brother Jesse is out here. I'll go show him to you. Ah. 
Okay, so we've talked a little about, about your life so far. But there's one boiling question that the fans want to know. All the JJ Jizzlers out there, but they want to know. Is she single or not? I'm not single. I'm taken by Marion. I'm not going to tell you his last name. She's taken by this boy named Marion. I'm in love with him. Okay, I was so let's just say that. You know, kids when they're our age, they don't know what real love really is. We just think that. I have a boyfriend you can dated say. him for three years on and off. Wow. I have a boyfriend you can say because he, it's more like a friendship, I think, and just with the label. I guess. When labels aren't... Well, it depends who you are. Labels can matter. But he's really nice to me, and he's good with my brother, so that's why I like him. But your boyfriend is kind of rude. No, he's not. Really? I read it. Hi. Show your face. Because I like you. No, they're not. Yeah. You're lucky. Don't touch out my house. Okay. Nobody's at my house. I'm at my grandma's house. The Kiki's not here. He. I told you to mute it. You I stupid. didn't mute it. <laughs> well, that was her boyfriend. Shh, okay, calm. Show him to the camera. <laughs> Show your face. Yes. Show your face. Please. Show your face. Show up fully for 10 seconds. No, see, I told you somebody's in. No, they're not. <laughs> Come on. Show your face. Numbers at my house. Nobody's at my house. Nobody's at my house. Nobody's at my house. Just show it for the documentary. Just show it. No, Kizzy. Show it. Kizzy. We're doing it. We're asking. I'm asking her questions about her boyfriend, and you're her boyfriend, so speak up. Yeah, speak up. I mean, what? The struggle. I said, I'll speak up about me not putting my face on the camera. Okay, love you, bye. Okay. Well, that was basically how Mari oh crap, how Marion is to her. So, yeah, that's all I gotta say about that. But thank you for the interview, Johanna. I guess the importance of relationships, relationships, and family does really matter to you. It does. And we work, we, you need to work on being more respectful. You are respectful, but you need to work on it, okay? Okay. Say bye to your fans. Bye, fans. Please state your name to the camera. My name is Margie Schillinger, but my grandkids call me Mima. Okay, Margie Schillinger. We would like you to tell us your funniest moment with your family and kids. My funniest moment, it started out as a scary moment, but we laughed about it later. We were all up snowmobiling up in the... Uh, Sundance Mountain, and um, I fell off. My daughter Angel was sitting in front of me. She was probably about, oh, maybe 
six, seven years old at the time. And she was sitting in front of me, and I fell off, but she was still on it. And it went down the hill. And um, it scared me. But she she stayed on it until it went to, down the bottom of the hill, and it stopped. And we had a nice laugh about it, but it was pretty scary at first. But... Um, Okay. There was the time when the lady at Rawhide Village came by, and uh, the kids and I, we would pray every night before they went to bed, and we'd put angels around the house, and a lady stopped me when I was out in the yard, and um, said, you're going to think I'm weird, but last night it was late. And it was real dark out, and everybody was sleeping. It was like 2 or 3 o'clock in the morning. And she said, my kitchen window looks right straight over to your house. And behind your green bronco, there was a fire. And it, it stayed there, and it didn't go out. And she said, I watched that for over an hour, and it didn't move. And I said, well, it was probably the prayers that my kids and I prayed every night before they went to bed. We would put angels around the house. And um, that was, the Bible talks about angels being flames of fire. So cheesecake. She liked it because I'm not she really didn't think of the house. Cheesecake. 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 Uh, this is for What are you doing? Stop. I'm texting you. No. This is Johanna Rose Staples, a.k.a. I can trust something you want to see. The mooch. <laughs> she has a dirty bedroom and wears her underwear five days in a row. No, I don't. <laughs> you know how to tell if your underwear is dirty? Just throw them up on the wall. If they stick, it's time to change it. <laughs> that's nasty. I didn't know that. I knew that's how you cook pasta, but I didn't know that's how you cook your underwear. <laughs> don't look at your face. <laughs> Does that take pictures too? Yeah, I'll have a picture of me and Papa on there. Mommy. Tonight on Queen Kizzy. Kiki. Jesse's birthday. He looks so serious. He must be on Tinder. He has Tinder. What's her name, Jesse? He does. <laughs> What's his name? Who's looking at the girl? What's his name? Do you want to cuddle? Is it double D staring? Do you want a drunk cuddle? Kiki. <laughs> <Stop>. <laughs> Kiki. <laughs> what did she say? There's, a, there's Ray has Big Daddy Ray. Wait, let's do a handshake. Wait, let's do a handshake. I'm trying to do that one really good. Big Daddy Ray, where did that come from? I don't know. It's just off the cuff. No. You guys put way too much into it. No, we you, don't. You got to keep it simple if you're going to do a secret handshake. It's got to be something simple. Try Show to do one a simple one. I showed him a simple one. I showed him one. about a drum kettle? Okay, no. <laughs> You want, you want some drum kettle? You want some kettle corn? You want some kettle corn? No. <laughs> I can make kettle corn. I know how to. I'm good. I can make some on the stove for you. I'm okay. Great. I make some for your birthday. So. I showed you the one me and my friends used to do. It was It was. Boom, 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 this is Lego <laughs> head, like angel hood. You and me, you and your friends are trying to do backflips and hold each other's legs and shake each other's hair braids what? and stuff all at the same time. You're going oh, wow. way too okay. overboard. I don't film well. There's Lyle. And there's Lyle. There's Lyle. <laughs> see his teeth? He's got teeth. Let me see. It doesn't look like it Wait up. Okay. Uh, uh, let's just do the face. That's nasty. <laughs> That's way <laughs> nasty. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she's over there fart laughing. Like every time she laughs, she farts again. But you fart. Let me you try to laugh about farting if you have to fart. Let me just itch my head. Snarts. <laughs> <laughs> what does she do? Let me mom she's like this. Let me just itch my head. This is what Joy Anna is like. I have that. Yeah, do it. I sit like this. You know what? We have a snap of you. We have a snap of you showing that finger. Yeah, me and Drake were in the car. I did it. Do it. I was just like this. And your finger just naturally goes like that. I feel like that all the time. She does what she we're going to have to cut your feet.
moments later. Go. <coughs> oh my goodness. Uh, that sucked. This should be your trigger finger and this should be your shot. What? Five, six, seven, eight. Mm, 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 mm. Oh, 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 oh. It's a big Oh, Five, fail. six, seven, eight. <laughs> Epic fail. We roll, roll, roll <laughs> your boat. <laughs> <laughs> Ship me down the stream. Oh, you wear a towel? <laughs> no. Or a bib? <laughs> And that's that's I I is that not what I just you said? That's what we're doing. And when you get out, you go right here. See? Oh, so that is what I said. And you have to use the heavier dice. I'm in Johanna's room right now. This is my documentary on Angel. Um, yeah. Angel's in here. Because Johanna left to go and eat with her dad at some restaurant. And I decided to stay here. So, New Year's was okay. I guess you could say New Year's was pretty good. We didn't do anything. We needed to hand this clean room because I really wanted to clean it. But, all in all, we just need to respect our parents because they do a lot for us and our family because that's the importance of family. It's just having a good time and respecting your peers, even though you don't always want to. But thank you for watching this, and I hope you like and subscribe and feel the vibe, because this was, like, very hard for me to do. So I don't really like to edit, but I had to. You know what I'm saying? So I hope you guys had a good Christmas and that we all have a good new year in 2019. <laughs> that we should just respect our peers more. Oh, right, Z. Good. But yeah, I'm back. And I'll see you in a few weeks. Because I'll be posting. Yeah. Bye. Good.